You're welcome. I'm David Fraser. This has been the end of a long, or this is almost the end of a long, long journey. A journey that ends in someone from Canada winning a bunkie. Oh man, I'm excited for tonight. I've been excited for all of them, but this is the most excited I've been of all of them. I gotta play a little bit of guitar and wait for everyone to join in. If you're here, comment. How excited on a scale of one to 10 are you for Sunday's winter announcement at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time? A little side request. If you could pound that share button, if you got a share button on this video, share it. Let's get this word out. This is the last Bunky Life TV before we announce the winner on Sunday night. And it's going to be a doozy. Because I'll never see the sun again if I am losing. No, I'll never see the sun again if I am losing you. Put a jacket on, shut the windows tight, we'll need an extra blanket to make it through the night. It came so slow, we didn't see it until it was already here. And I feel like we are changing with seasons of the year oh where have you gone a summer's day all the leaves are on the ground and the birds have flown away the trees all look so naked and i feel naked too cause i'll never see the sun again if i am losing So many things I did without thinking about So many things I did I should have done without Now the words I've left unspoken Are now completely gone Now all I can do is try my best To get the furnace on Oh, where have you gone? summer's day all the leaves are on the ground and the birds have flown away the trees all look so naked and i feel naked too cause i'll never see the sun again if i am losing you these hands that once were warm feel so cold these face that used to smile feel so old. I need you now more than ever so come back where have you gone my summer's day all the leaves are on the ground And the birds have flown away And the trees all look so naked And I feel naked too Because I'll never see the sun again If I am losing you Where have you gone? My summer's day all the leaves are on the ground And the birds have flown away And the trees all look so naked And I feel naked too Cause I'll never see the sun again If I am losing you No, I'll never see the sun again If I am
Hi, I'm David Fraser, founder of Bunky Life. We're in the building industry, but what we're famous for are small log cabins called bunkies that can be easily built in a weekend without a permit or a second mortgage. Ultimately, we help our clients create extra space for more meaningful connection. Yes, we help our clients get a cool bunkie. But if you think it's just about the bunkie, you've already missed the point. Really what this is about is creating the space and time for more meaningful connection. And having a bunkie is just part of that journey. It's not just about the space. It's about what happens in the space, how it enables more connection. It allows you to spend that quality time with family and friends. It allows you to be there for each other in both senses of the phrase. We are the market leaders in educational videos and content. And we also provide an easy to build or built for you bunkie kit that enables people to have more space to connect. The bunkie is often the difference between that friend or family member coming or not being there for each other or not. The reason we do this is because we believe family comes first. And when it comes to being there for each other, there are no do-overs. That's one of the reasons we've decided to partner with Ronald McDonald House Charities of Canada in their goal of keeping families close. Because ultimately, we want to bring about a world where families everywhere have a place to unite, unwind, and unplug. I get up every morning excited to help families create extra space for meaningful connection. Thanks for listening and can't wait to hear from you. All right, guys, are we pumped? Are we excited? I'm super excited. I uh, I, I don't think I've been as ex- this excited for a live stream in a long time. Um, and the reason why is we're, we're doing something crazy. So we'll get to that in a second. But uh, first and foremost, what's more important to you, winning a bunkie or football? It's a weird question to ask, but I'm going to ask it right now, and then you'll find out why. So uh, if you could decide, winning a bunkie, football, what's more important to you? Uh, that would be interesting. Uh, uh, Teresa Thao from Canada says, winning a bunkie, great choice. Oh, I, met, I clicked on the wrong one. Winning a bunkie, she says, very good choice. Grant Joseph, winning a bunkie. Let's see what everybody else says. Bunkie, winning a bunkie, or football, what's more important? Um, we got... Winning a bunky seems like winning a bunky seems to be the winning. I don't see any footballs. Bunky, bunky, bunky. Winning a bunky. Tammy says, a lot of people saying bunky. Uh, I don't see any footballs, uh, which is too bad for the football, the NFL, um, because you may. <laughs> Hold on, I'm scrolling down. Somebody says I don't even care about football. Okay. Uh, somebody says they dislike. Well, you don't have to hate football. I'm just saying, what's more important, right? So, here's the cool. Well, I'm scrolling down, and there's so many comments. We have. Over 400 people watching this, so this is crazy. So um, so here's the deal, guys. You don't need to choose. Sunday night, um, me being a not super in plug with pop culture kind of guy, I forgot it was Super Bowl <laughs> Sunday, actually, to be honest, on Sunday. Set up this contest dates well before I even thought of that. So it is Super Bowl Sunday. Uh, the live stream where we announce the winner of the 2021 Winter Bunky Contest is going to be clashing with Super Bowl. But here's the cool thing. You don't need to choose, guys. You can have the Super Bowl on. On one screen, you can have me on another screen. No big deal. And I promise you, we will be done before the end of the Super Bowl. Super Bowl isn't even fun until, uh, well, in my opinion, as a musician, the halftime show. And then after that, uh, like the last two minutes of the game are the exciting minutes. And they drag them out, of course, right? Um, So unless it's a blowout and it's boring the whole way, um, the last bit of the thing is the fun part anyways. So don't worry about it. You're not going to miss anything. Tune into the Bunky Life thing. Um, a lot of people are going to ask, Dave, if I don't tune in to watch the contest live, uh, will I lose my chance to win? No, we'll still w- we'll still email the winner, but guys, you got to tune in live. It's going to be so fun. It's going to be exciting. There'll be jokes, prizes, music, etc. But if you don't tune in live and then I email you and I call you and I don't get a hold of you, eventually I'm going to have to give the prize to someone else. So you want to tune in live, okay? So make sure you do that. It's just a mere few days away. Sunday, February 7th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I won't belabor the point anymore, but you don't need to choose between Bunky and football, okay? I really appreciate that. That for those of you saying I love you more than football, <laughs> you, you rock, but, uh, you know, okay. <laughs> this is a good, great comment here. Oh, the bowl I care about is a bowl full of chips. Nice, Holly. I like that one. Okay. All right, let's do this. Let's, this is what we're going to talk about today. Our agenda. Uh, we're going to talk gonna talk about the winter announcement this Sunday, how it's going to go down. I guess I kind of did, just did that. Um, and then we're going to talk about, we have a, a real Bunky Lifer story. And then we're going to talk about um, the real reason we're here, which is we're going to be unveiling all the new products we're launching this year. So they're very exciting. And let's do this. Okay. 
Okay, so this is kind of the, uh, I mean, we've got through five live streams, guys. This is the fifth one. And then, of course, the winner is going to, so this is tonight we're the unveiling. Uh, and then Sunday, we're going to be announcing the winner. So here's the deal. Uh, right after that, I don't I want to believe this point, but we have our epic sale. It's our biggest deal of the year. Up to $1,000 off our best-selling bunkies, $500 off our other bunkies as well. Um, I'll talk about that at the end of this live stream, but it is always the best pricing of the year. I kid you not. It's the best time to order a bunkie, even if you don't want it till the fall or you don't want it till the spring or summer. The best time to order is now. We can hold it for you till you're ready. It's all good. If you wait until May or June to get your bunkie, uh, don't do that. Don't be that guy. Okay. So, um, yeah, that's all I'll say about that. Let's get to a bunkie lifer story and then we'll get into tonight's presentation. We thought that the uh, bunky itself was, was an amazing idea. They look so good. Um, we've got uh, two of them actually. The 2019 with no loft and the washing bunky side by side. What do you like it? Um, I love the privacy and the amount of space for just me is um, awesome. And I have like one of the best sleeps in there every night. Um, when it rains, I can hear everything on the roof, which is pretty cool. And yeah, it's just very comfortable. Oh, it just gives you an extra room, really. Um, you can put them anywhere. The, the floor plan um, doesn't require a, a permit, which is fantastic. And it just makes your place look fantastic. It gives you a different look. and in that extra room. Okay, before we get into this, I, I wanted to share one comment. So uh, Wendy says, I know you're crazy busy, but I sent an email asking about bunkies and still waiting to hear back. Wendy, if you could maybe resend it. We had um, a few problems with our email earlier this month um, and our phone system was a little bit wacky. So the phone has been ringing off the hook to be quite frank. So uh, if you don't get hold of this right away, try again. Uh, my profuse apologies. I think we have that all sorted out. But it is important that, uh, you know, we do our best to respond to you. I want to give a shout out to my team of people. Uh, Shannon, Heather, uh, Bryn, Andrew, my wife, Carrie. Guys, you've been crushing it this past couple of days. We threw this presentation together basically 20 minutes ago. Uh, we had, well, I won't get into all the details, uh, but basically this has been brewing for a year all these things we're gonna all these ideas we're gonna be unleashing in just five seconds um but it took a team effort to get it all together in a presentable format i get all the credit but that's really not fair because everyone else that i just mentioned is the real people that pull it all together so thank you amazing bunky life team uh and let's get back to wendy <laughs> sorry wendy we'll get back to you all right okay let's do this this tonight's presentation is called the unveiling Okay, so I'm gonna get some things out of the way. So let's do this. All right. So I'd say we get three common questions. I'd say the most common ones are, you know, what about a staircase? What about, a, you know, what? how can we uh, get the staircase going on, okay? Um, what if I have to move? Do you have a movable bunkie? How can I move the bunkie? And then of course, do you have a four season insulated bunkie? Those are the three most common questions I would say of, of our clients and of our potential clients. They always want to know these three things. And so we thought, what better time to solve this than February 4th of 2021, okay? So let's do this. Well, here's what we've been cooking up. We call this the unveiling. Ah, dramatic sip. Okay, common question number one. Do you guys have stairs? What about stairs? Now, I'm gonna get into this, but I wanna tease this with this, okay? Stairs is a legal term according to a building code inspector. It means specific things. So I might use the word stairs in some of these videos you're about to see. Stairs is not actually legally, uh, I'm not using it in the legal sense. I'm just using it like, you know, it feels like you're walking upstairs, okay? Um, technically, I'm about to show you a ladder, okay? It's a ladder, a compact fold-up ladder, but I may use the word stairs. Uh, you get the idea when you see myself and my parents using it. Um, that it's very stair-like, but I can't legally use the word stairs. So please ignore that when I say that. Um, let's show you how this works. Okay, so we partnered with an amazing Australian company called B Compact, and they have figured out a way to make this in Canada. We call this 
the award-winning patented fold flat compact ladder. Watch this. This is the kind of the idea. And let me let me show you how this all comes together. We built it this morning. We got it yesterday from Quebec. And we built it this morning and it came together like a dream. Let me show you this. Hey everyone, it's David from Bunky Life, and I want to show you the absolutely fresh off the press, made in Canada, Bunky Stairs Ladder System. So, this is a 2020 Bunky. This is a custom made system just for this Bunky. And as you can see right now, it's completely flat, flush against the wall. So, I'm able to use all this space over here. I can have a chair, whatever I need to do. It's all usable space. And if I'm ready to go up and go up to my loft and chill out there, I just have to pull it down. It firmly locks into place. And it's very easy to do with even just one hand as I just did that there because of the patented pulley system we have there. And then I've got a really great set of stair ladders. So watch this. I basically feel like I'm walking up a set of stairs. And now I'm up into my loft. Everything locks firmly into place. Everything is pre-assembled, so really all you have to do is put in maybe 10 screws and you're ready to go. And the whole thing um, is made in Canada, every single part. And when you're done, you can walk back down. And with a nice little jerk here, you can pop it right out and it all slides right back flat, right back flush, and you got all 9.99 square meters available to you again. So I hope you guys love this one. It's gonna be available as an upgrade to the 2019 and 2020 loft bunkies this year. And uh, if you're interested in ordering that, adding it to your order, let us know. It feels like stairs, eh? It feels like stairs. Oh, it's solid. This, this is better than a lot. Because, yeah, it's nice. Wow. Yeah. Want to check it out, Dad? And it's easy. Yeah. Look at how people coming in all the time. Okay, that, that is, that's pretty cool. Huh? Oh, yeah. Isn't that solid? Yeah. All right. See, isn't that nice as the water? That feels safe. Yeah, you got a handrail. Yeah, you got a handrail and it feels yeah. safer. It's at the better angle. Yeah, yeah. and, and, and okay. that's great. That's fantastic. We have some wall. For old guys like him, maybe walking down easy yet. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now come down and see how it's. I'll show you the clothes, yeah. So, I mean, I one thing I really like about it is. Um, so, is it's left? Left? Yeah, well, hold on. It's, there's a little bit of a kind of catch. You gotta kind of go almost like push out this way. Oh, okay. Because yeah. Yeah. you don't want to just be able to walk by and then nudge it and it flies up. Wait, right? somebody, yeah. So it's, it's, it's on a spring, so it's not, you know. Okay, walk keep, in lock, and then you got Kind of give it a bit of a jerk. There's a, there's a catch. Yeah, oh, yeah. See? there you go. So unlock. Yeah. Okay. It's kind of a catch, so it doesn't, it doesn't just fly up. Yeah. yeah, that is awesome. Yeah. Sorry guys, I muted myself there. Um, let's go back. Okay, hold on. So I'm gonna go talk about all the features. So, uh, like I say, it's gonna be ready to install on a 2019 or 2020 Bunky with Loft. Like I was saying, I, I literally got it straight from Quebec off a truck last night at like seven o'clock. Uh, myself and my friend put it in today. Uh, it took us about an hour and a half, but had I known the right way and the right directions, which we filmed, we filmed what we did, so we. Um, so it'll be really easy for the next person to do it. Um, I would, it would have been probably a 45 minute install. Everything was pre bun boom, boom, boom. I had to put in 10 screws. That was it. 10 screws. So, uh, it's custom made for the 2020 or it's custom made for the 2019 loft bunkies. Okay. So people are asking, uh, you know, I have, here's an example of a question here. Oh, 
this might not pop up. Uh, Francis Ruth Carroll Kitchen asks, wow, I have my 2019 already on order. Can I get those stairs? Yes. So you can add it to your order and it will replace the standard kind of ladder that we that we supply. Um, and then some people are asking, can these easily be added onto an existing bunkie? Yes. So I just um, I just put mine in. I had the previous, previously I had a ladder right where Declan is there. Um, and it was quite simple to do. So um, we'll, we'll have more questions. We'll have Q&A at the end of this, but I just wanted to have as an overview answer those questions. So it's designed by Australian Zev Bianchi, uh, made in Canada with sustainable bamboo. Um, so here's the pricing. It's $29.95 if delivered with a bunkie. And that's our worst case scenario. This is our prototype that we kind of uh, put together and kind of, like I said, got today. That's our worst case scenario. We're trying to figure out how can we ec economize this for the bunkie scenario and here in Canada. Um, but we, do, we don't want to make it in China or some any other place. We want to make it right here in Canada. So um, so we're trying to figure out the most economical way to do that. And we're in talks with, uh, with B Compact to do that. So um, I'm going to talk about this later, but basically if you put down a deposit and you want to get this in your life, uh, $500 uh, will put down a deposit on this this add-on, we'll call it, and uh, and then you'll be guaranteed the lowest price, um, and you'll save five hundred dollars off of the twenty nine ninety five. So it'll be twenty four ninety five in that case, right? Um, and that's uh, for any any existing client that's already buying a bunkie. If we have to ship one specifically to you and you don't have a bunkie, or don't have our bunkie, then it might be more. So we'll we'll get into at the end of this presentation kind of how we're answering questions and doing things uh, with our new stuff, but. That's kind of the idea. So what do you guys think? I'd love to hear your comment below. Uh, how excited are you about this? How do you feel about the price point? I mean, it's not the cheapest thing in the world. But I tell you, like having seen it in person, the quality is there. It's such a quality piece of every every piece is just perfectly formed and designed. And it's a really, you know, thank you so much to the, the team that put this all together. Um, Bryn for setting this up, Carrie for making it happen, and all the B Compact team. It's it's a cool partnership. So um, that's uh, you know that's kind of where we're at. People are saying it's pretty cool. Um, yeah. So, anyways, that's the idea. Um, we'll move on to the next one that we're because this is just one of three things. Okay, let's do it. Question number two: What if we have to move? Do you have a movable bunkie, Dave? And that's where we're going with that. Okay, let's do it. Okay, this is what we call the trailer monkey. This is a time lapse of me building it. Okay, so this is our trailer bunkie. Functional, fun, also made in Canada 100%. The, the trailer's made in Canada, the, the wood's made in Canada, the, the, the kit itself. Um, and yeah, so this is a very exciting addition to the idea. Wait, Carrie's saying, take the Facebook off the screen. What does that mean? Hmm, well, I don't know. So this is the um, Bunky Life Trailer Bunky. And we built it in basically two days. Oh, there's a comment across the screen. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Thank you, guys. I gotta take that off. Sorry, guys. Hold on. Give me one second. That's how you know it's live because <laughs> I'm terrible at this stuff. My bad. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Carrie, for all your all caps comment. Sometimes you just need... To, an all caps coming from your wife while you're doing a live stream for 500 people. Just happens. All right. Okay. Thanks for thanks for clarifying that, everybody. We're back on track. Let's go back a little bit in case you missed something. This is the this is the time lapse once again. Ah, Dave. Yeah. So this is a really fun to build thing, and uh, luckily we had a semi heated garage to do it in. It was super fun. So yeah. You could drag this out as a nice hut. You could use it as a, as a mobile sauna to go. There's a lot of uses for this, but this is kind of the idea. Um, so it's made in Canada, like I was saying. There's two separate rooms inside. There's kind of a central uh, wall there in the middle, and I'll show you that later. Um, and no permit required, obviously, because it's more like a trailer. Uh, and here's kind of the details. So I think you could probably build, like you can either build it yourself or we could build it for you, but count on probably two or three days. 
like I said, it's Maine, Canada. Super easy to insulate the floor or the roof. So in that video, you could see we there's a, a nice space there for insulation, no problem. Super, super killer. Um, and uh, this is um, actually square footage wise, it's like two rooms of about about 50 square feet. So it's about it's about it's about 100 square feet. But you don't need to worry if you're on wheels, you don't need to worry about permits as much. So it is bigger than a typical 10 square meter thing. But yeah, all the specs will be on uh, uh, that product page. So bunkylife.com slash product slash bunky dash trailer. You can see all that stuff. So yeah, um, there's lots of options in terms of how to stain it and finish it and such. And we're kind of guesstimating as a, as a price range. Uh, if you, you know, get the kit uh, unbuilt and you build it yourself, probably ballpark about 14 to 950. If we do everything for you and just drive it to you and it's all stained and all good and all finished, uh, you want to budget about 19 950 for it. All right. And in terms of technical specs, uh, you can find all that, a lot of that stuff on the, uh, on the page. All right. That is an exciting development. And so this is a video of me silently miming my way through it. The trailer's included, the bunkies included, it's all one big unit. With our standard awesome door, walk in, the, the, the key of course is included in the locking system. And I think we had stained the floor, but the roof is also, the ceiling is included there. And that window, that, that back room would be sweet for like a, a little bed. You could throw a bed back there or a hot tub. Yeah. And that's kind of the epic trailer bunkie. And there's a nice little front porch. Just you can put a little chair out there. I think if you wanted to kind of chill. All right, and the windows are tempered glass so that they can be used to travel. All right, so you know, there's a lot of technical questions coming through in the comments, um, and they'll be on the page as we as we uh, as we get those details for you. Um, but we're not going to get too into the weeds since we got a third epic thing to tell you guys about. I can't believe it. I'm I'm already winded, and I'm only two thirds of the way through. All right, let's do this. Okay, do you have any four season bunkies? That is a very, very common question. So let's get into it. I'll precursor this. We were actually approached about three weeks ago by this company, um, Ferris Builds, and they have an amazing system that's patented. It's called the Harmonic System. And what it is is a combination of steel and um, really high quality foam. And so this is... Th the product of this partnership. Let me show you. I'd like to present to you guys the Bunky Life Insulated Four Season Bunky. So what you're seeing here is a computer, computer rendering. Um, this is using the new system. This could be built in about a day or two. Um, this has a kind of wood looking siding on it. There's tons of different options. Um, and you can see there's a solar panel rendered. That's an option as well for this Bunky. Um, and very, very cool um, front face here, as you'll see. This one here is exactly just under the permit size as well. Although the cool thing about this is it's also made in Canada. It's a great company from Kingston area and they're manufactured right here. So we can actually custom make pretty much anything using this new system. This has like a shiplap kind of look on the inside. And uh, yeah, we are so jazzed about this one. So some people are commenting, nice, four season bunky. My cottage is four season and you never regret having four seasons. Yes. I always tell everybody our kind of traditional wood wood um, bunkies are great. You can get them up to about 3.8 seasons. Um, but this is for like how to get it to the next level. And for those of you who are working from home, uh, we feel you. That's, the, that's kind of the, the main use case we're thinking of is like great home office or studio. So um, here's an example of of kind of a, a built for you in one to two days. And we can, the cool thing about our new system is we can do it even in the dead of winter, we can still put this stuff together. Here's an example of one we just did uh, not too long ago. Kind of a prototype idea. So, okay, I'm gonna pause, can I pause it? Yes, I can. So you guys, oh, no, to go back, Dave. Okay, so this, pausing might be tricky. Sorry, I'm not quite an expert, but yeah, 
I'll just show you guys this. So the system is, you can see there's steel and foam, and that's kind of the actual structure of the building. And then from there, you can add any siding or any finishing look you want. So that's kind of the idea here. And this whole thing, put this whole, we got the whole structure up here uh, in, I think, about a day. And then from there, it was some finishing and such and waiting for windows. So we'll get into cost in just a second, FYI. Okay, so... So many different uses. Here's another kind of a just really rough example of what it could finish like. Um, obviously, great as a home office, extra sleeping space, a studio. Uh, let's say you're a tired dad of three. You maybe you need a nap cabin. I mean, I'm not going to judge you. Um, I could use a nap cabin right now. <laughs> oh my goodness, my wife could use a nap cabin. So that's kind of the concept. Um, and we are ready to roll the stuff out. Uh, it's going to take about six to eight weeks to get this stuff actually like ready to go for everybody. Um, but the cool thing about it, because it's made in Canada, um, because it's not super wood intensive, uh, it's not subject to the same pressures that our wood products are going to be subject to. So yeah, make a really awesome music room, Shelly Lynn Passfield. Yeah. So that's kind of the concept. We're so excited about this partnership. Um, and there's a lot more flexibility with this stuff. You can kind of be, get a little more creative on how you want to finish it. So, all right, let's talk about the features. So, like I said, built for you on site. Um, right now, built for you is the only option. Uh, we love that our wood bunkies are so easy to build that most clients can build it themselves with relatively half decent handyman skills. Um, that's really great. But because this is an engineered product um, and we're just getting it off the ground, uh, the, for this year, we're going to have built for you only. So we'll come, uh, we'll build the exterior, uh, the exterior of the bunkie. We'll put the exterior siding and the roof on and install the windows and such. Um, but then there's, there is a little bit of a DIY, op, what DIY do it yourself option if you want to save some money. So, uh, we can also put, have it plug in ready for electrical. So you just need an electrician to come and, and put in the wires, but the main work of the cavities of where everything's going can be, re, can be pre-done for you. And like I said, lots of options for how do you finish it? Um, so the price is going to kind of range. It's probably going to be about 19, 950. If you put in some of that sweat equity and maybe do the flooring and the finishing on the inside. Um, or if we just do everything, 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 and you just kind of walk into your bunkie and, and, and go, probably you want to budget about twenty nine nine fifty, okay? And that's for something that's, you know, just under the permit size. So you shouldn't need a permit in most areas. Obviously, you want to look, uh, look into, uh, you know, your local mafia, but that's kind of the idea. Um, and the cool thing about this particular way of building is we can do larger, we can pretty much make anything happen, and we have the engineering ready to go. Uh, through our partnership with Ferris Build. So if you want a bigger, huge studio and you don't mind going through the expense of the permit, we can make it happen now. So um, we're very excited about this. Um, if you have, like, I'll get into kind of how it's going to work, but basically um, these th these three new things, because we're filling them out, there's going to be so many questions. Um, we have a, a system in, in mind because, uh, as you know, we're about to start our epic sale on our normal, awesome Bunky products. So let's get into that. Okay, so here is. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this presentation about our exciting new 2021 lineup. As you probably know, we're about to start our epic winter sale. It's $1,000 off the 2020 Loft Bunky that I'm standing in, as well as our super popular 2019 Loft Bunky. And it's also $500 off everything else. So it's our best deal of the year, and it's also the busiest time we ever have as a company. So what I'd like to invite you to do, if you're excited about the new ladder stairs system, if you're excited about a trailer bunky, if you're excited about the new four season insulated bunky, you know, raise your hand and say, hey, uh, I'm serious about this. You know, I'm, I'm ready to move forward. Maybe I have a few questions, but I'm pretty much there. Uh, so we'd like to invite you to do that. So the way you can do that is uh, head to our website, bunkylife.com and click on the pro individual product page and put down a small $500 deposit. And what that will guarantee you is a sit down chat after the contest is done, um, the week of February 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th, and 19th, um, we'll sit down uh, via Zoom or a phone call with myself, Bryn, Andrew, one of our team members, and yourself, just to find, make sure you know that this product is the right fit for you and your situation. And if it is, great. That deposit will be fully uh, put towards the purchase. And if not, no hard feelings, full refund right on the spot. Um, but we just want to be able to separate the people who are serious from the people who are kind of just, you know, generally asking questions. So we won't be able to respond to questions about the new products 
uh, until after the sale is over and after we've chatted with all the crew that, uh, you know, we're bold enough to say, yes, I'm in, uh, let's do this, okay? So um, you can do that uh, as of right now on our product page and uh, we look forward to serving you guys. This is gonna be an amazing 2021. We couldn't have done it without your support, your feedback, your ideas. Thank you so much, Monkey Life Community. We'll talk to you soon. All right, so that's kind of the idea. So there's lots of questions. Oh, hold on. Yeah, there's lots of questions out there. Um, some of them I have answers for. Some of them I actually might need to confer with the the engineers and, and the, those kind of uh, people. But uh, that's kind of a nice presentation. If you have questions, fire them below, guys. I want to hear, um, you know, of the three things, what are you most excited about of the three new things, if anything? Um, and then from there, uh, you know, is anybody going to seriously think about putting a deposit down? That would be very exciting for us. Because people always go, hey, can you do this? Can you do that? Well, we made it happen. We made it real. Now the question is, if you build it, will they buy? That is the question we've been having for the past couple of weeks. So, yeah. Now, um, sorry if I'm tripping at the microphone. Um, yeah, our, our Epic sale, I don't want to harp on this too much, but it is going to be, uh, like, it is every year our biggest sale of the year. So, um, let me get to that. Uh, okay, so let's talk. We'll, we'll come back to questions and answers. So start, start typing those questions below. We'll come right back to it. Um, so I want to remind you guys one more time. Our epic sale starting uh, basically now. It goes until Sunday, uh, the 14th of February. Please, please, please don't wait until the 14th of February, which is Valentine's Day, to like if you if you if, you, if you're thinking on the 15th, you get, we'll still give you the sale price. My wife says no. We gotta like shut it down. We're gonna try to take uh, 15th and 16th off. Um, and it's always our best, our best um, sale of the year. And there's an, a very uh, self-explanatory reason. Right now, you can buy wood. It's not too crazy. But as soon as the summer hits and everyone starts building their decks and everything, the price of everything is going to go crazy. It's already gone crazy. Um, but the best time to buy is now. We cannot lock in prices. We cannot guarantee prices for the whole year. Uh, the way that the world's been the last little bit, it's impossible to predict. So we bought all the wood for most of you guys. For this spring, if you order now, if you wait, can't guarantee the pricing is going to be the same and can't guarantee we can even get stuff. So let me show you a little article I saw today on CBC. Um, lumber boom, great news for industry, but expect higher constru construction prices. Higher prices for lumber have added about 30 G's to the cost of the typical new home. And the similar pressures on the bunkies because most of our products are made from wood. So uh, that's another reason we're so excited about our insulated bunkie. There's less wood involved. Uh, however... If you're thinking about, you know, a summer cabin, uh, a 2019 bunkie with loft, whatever the, the product you're thinking, you you definitely want to get on that ball, okay? So I'm not going to harp on it too much, but that February sale, uh, the epic winter sale, it's ending on Valentine's Day. And no, you can't come see the bunkie after that unless you've got a deposit down. All right. So um, let's get to questions here. I'm going to try my best to answer them. And if I can't... Um, Please forgive me. Okay, let's let's address this. So Karen says, love the stairs, but not the way it cut, cuts across the window. Could the window be shifted in the new builds? We're, we're considering that. Now, the thing is the existing ladder also cut across the window like that. Um, so it's, it's just par for the course right now, but we may redesign that for next year. So, and on the 2019, the windows can be put on either side. So you could put the window on one side, put the ladder on the other side, no blocksies. But on the 2020, you will lose one window. But it's not the whole window because that window on that side is actually two windows. So this one can still open, this one might get blocked or vice versa. Yeah. Sarah Fulbert asks, the, the 500 bucks off the 2019 Bunky No Lock, it's truly the only option for my space, but I'm waiting to see if I run a winner up prize. Can I put down 500 now and see if I win? Yeah, if you win, uh, if you win a prize, we'll deduct that off your total. No, no problem. Yep. All right. Can you add a snow and ice stopper to the roof? Yes, you can. That's a good idea, actually. <laughs> My husband and I literally talk a dream about winning every day when we go in our lockdown box. That's cool. Well, I hope you guys I wish you all the best.
This is a long story. I just built a four season cottage in August. I have about seven to 9,000 I could add to one that I won, but with just spending 250,000 on my cottage, not ready for a deposit. If I won, I would add to the price and get a better, bigger bunkie. Okay, well, we'll hope, we'll see how it turns out. We have 110,000 people in the contest right now. Uh, my 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 wishes for you is that uh, you have the best of luck, but I wish that for every, every one of the 110,000 people. Uh, Ricardo asks, can you put two bunkies together? I wouldn't recommend it. Uh, it's possible, but it's probably easier just to get a bigger bunkie. We can make a custom wood bunkie or a custom four season bunkie now. So maybe that's a better option. Regarding the stairs, what's the weight limit? I don't know the answer to that. If the, uh, if the B compact people are watching, if you could comment, that would be interesting to see. Um, but I don't know the answer to that question, but I would assume it's quite high. Like they, they're very, very solid. Um, they look, they look, um, kind of, uh, small, like, like minute, but they're not, they're very, very, uh, solid. Uh, it's made from a really high quality, sustainable bamboo mixed with a hard wood. So like they were solid. Do you need a special permit to take a bunky on trailer and move down the road? No, um, you'll just need a, a normal trailer permit, which we'll get for you if you're buying it from us. A lot of people asking what the weight limit for the stairs are. So, so I don't know the answer, but I would assume it's quite high. So I'll, I'll get an, an exact answer for you and I'll put it on the product page. I can actually show you guys the product page later. Oh, this is actually a good reason. Tanya Swain asks, where do you put the deposit? Okay. This is where I thank Heather once again for always saving my bacon. Heather just created these pages today. So you're, what you're going to do if you, um, if you want to put down a deposit is you're going to go to bunkylife.com. Okay. Um, okay. Let's, here it is. So bunkylife.com. You're going to click on products and there's all the ones that are new. They say new. So let's say you wanted to do the compact ladder. I haven't even seen this page yet. I'm sure it's amazing. Okay. So here's the page. So, um, like I said, worst case, this is this 29.95 is the worst case scenario pricing. Absolute worst case. Um, and what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down. You know, here's the specs for it, blah, blah, blah. And you're going to click add to cart. And then you're going to click view cart. Oh, I have some other stuff in my cart, but I'll get rid of it. So, so it's asking for, you know, $500 plus tax as a deposit. Um, you, you'd proceed to check out any of your details like that. And then we'll have that conversation uh, sometime after Valentine's Day. Once everything settles down, we can have a conversation. Okay, which way do you want the ladder to swing? Uh, which one, you know, how high do you want us to make the ladder? It'll either be the 2019 or the 2020. So that's kind of the, and same thing with the, you know, the insulated bunky, for example, because there's some cool options available here. We want to have that conversation. So uh, scroll down, add to cart, exactly the same way as the other one. So if you want to put down a deposit on those, that's how you do it there, Tanya Swain. All right. Okay. I'm going to keep motoring through these amazing questions. Thank you so much for tuning in, all 550 of you. Can you deliver to an island? Absolutely. We go. We deliver to islands all the time. So if you're water access only, we can usually get to the marina and you can go from there um, or we can figure something out. That'd be a good question for Shannon. Oh, it would be cool to add Murphy beds. Yeah, I um, we're, that's something we're, we're looking into right now. So it might be a 2022 project. All right. Does the deposit now ensure the sale price? Yes, it does, jo Joanne Jordan. Great question. And once again, if you put, in, put down a deposit on any of our things and you need to back out, uh, that's doable. Uh, we have a 30-day money-back guarantee on all of our stuff, as well as a five-year warranty. So last year, we sold a ton of bunkies in February, and then March hit when the world collapsed. Some people lost their jobs and stuff, and we just, you know, we got their money back usually within like a few days. So you can find out more in the Bunky Life Agreement. Just watching a video on building the Bunky, they are well built. Yes, thank you. Joy says, love the new winterized cabin. Still love the original. Love the book you wrote, and I finally got to actually read it. Can it be, a, can tin be a purchase when buying? Tin. Um, do you mean the roof? I'm not sure what you mean, Joyce. Could you elaborate on that? Thanks for the kind words, though. Is there a four season with loft? 
stay tuned. We're going to release more information about that as we, as we go. How far into the bush can you guys come to build it? We have a hunting camp and I need a bunkie for me. So it depends on, on the one. So if you want, uh, you know, one of the built for you options, uh, you know, we can set you up with someone that can do it. Um, we've done some really remote locations over the years. Awesome. Insulated bunky. Can you add windows? Yeah. The coolest. I forgot. I should have mentioned that earlier. Thanks Susan Devitt. You can add windows wherever you want. We can engineer all that stuff in ahead of time, or you can cut it out after the fact too. So, uh, really easy to retrofit or, or think ahead and, and order it. So, um, what I showed you is kind of what, what we're thinking of, of kind of rolling out as a main product, but we're going to have other customization options too. Would the four season loft be able to have, the four season doesn't have a loft right now, but uh, if we make one, then yes, well, make sure it's big enough for a queen size bed. I'm about to have three or four small micro cabins built on my new property, looking at several different styles to add character. But if I win a bunkie, I'll definitely add a bathroom one too. Cool. Just incredible TV. Can bunkies be insulated? Yes. Our wood ones can be the roof and the floor. Check out bunkie insulation. If you type that into YouTube, there'll be some videos of me doing some. Um, but you can get up to about 3.9 seasons for most Canadians. If you want to go to that next level, check out the four season bunkie we just talked about. Is there one to sale on now? Basically, yes. We're we're uh, we're we're uh, we're taking orders right now. We've I've already sold a ton of bunkies in the past week or two, um, and it officially kicks off after the contest closes. But you know, let's not split hairs, Nancy. Let's do this. Let's do this, Nance. Scott McCready. Okay, so Scott's with uh, with Ferris Builds. So um, really, really great guy. Helped me put that presentation together. By, by the way, your new four season bunkies with Ferris can also go on a trailer. Okay, so you can combine two things together, right? Uh, you could have your four season bunkie on a trailer. Very cool concept. S Matthew Tromblay says, safe working load for ladders is approximately 200 kgs. Times that by 1.6. We're talking about a morbidly obese per person there. 200, 200 kgs, that would be. So basically they're safe unless you, um, you know, are, are morbidly, morbidly obese. Oh, here's comp. Okay. David only caught the task end of this wrong time. Uh, we have loaded the stair version of the middle with over 2,300 pounds. Okay. So basically this, this thing is indestructible is what, is what, as I was saying here. So thanks buddy. Um, so yeah, it, unless you have an elephant that wants to climb the stairs, you should be solid on these stairs. And, and uh, having put, walked up and down it a bunch of times today, they're very solid. Keith asks, can we get delivery in May if we were to order during winter sale? Yes, you can get delivery really anytime now and between now and the end of the season. Um, you don't need to take delivery right away. We can hold it for you. Uh, but like I said, the best time to order is now so we can get all their wood put together and all our windows bought and blah, 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 get everything ready for you. Um, if you wait till May, it's going to be tricky. I can just foresee that, although no one can predict the future. Karen says, the new designs are great. I really like the looks of the four season bunkie, but I missed the loft space. Could be made a bit higher to accommodate a loft. We're working on that, Karen. So great feedback. I'm sure the uh, people um, from Ferris Builds are watching and uh, we're we're putting that together too. So put down at a $500 deposit. We can make it happen for you. <laughs> and we can have a good chat in a couple weeks. How do you know I'm here to collect these chances? Okay, we're going to say a code word in just a few minutes. When I say that code word, you're going to go to the Bunky Life contest scoreboard and enter that code word in, but I haven't said it yet. So thank you for keeping me honest, Tim Zavitz. Okay, scrolling down. A lot of people are saying, I love the insulated Bunky, but like a loft. Okay, I think we're gonna have a solution for you very shortly. So maybe put a deposit down, we'll chat. <laughs> thank you for all the time and the fast opportunity to purchase or win a Bunky. Thank you for the kind words, Carla Mead. <laughs> Audrey, I'm on board as I want more guests at the cottage. Hubby says better with fewer guests. So we'll have to get that resolved first. <laughs> Absolutely. We don't want to split up marriages. Uh, but I find every marriage has that gas and that breaks. Our marriage is no different. Um, so, you know, one person's going to win and one person's going to lose. But everyone wins in the end when you stay married. Is there a code word? Yes, there is, but I haven't said it yet, Susan Dahl. 
What's the biggest difference between you and your competitors? Well, you're watching my live stream. You're probably learning a ton here. So I'd say we're leading uh, the charge in terms of education, putting things forward, moving the industry forward as a whole. Um, and also, most of our stuff is made 100% here in Canada. We emphasize Canadian products for Canadian people. Um, we're not just ripping off cheap Russian stuff or uh, Chinese stuff or anything like that. We're, we're selling you a product that uh, we stand behind for five years um, or more. Um, and we have a really great Bunky Life community of people that kind of get our vision of wanting to bring about a better world, wanting to help families stay close. So there's a, there's a, a lot a lot to kind of dig through, I think, with our company. But uh, yeah, you're going to find there's other Shed and Bunky companies out there that are uh, cheaper, I'm sure. So we're doing, we don't compete on price. But uh, like I just bought, I'm, I'm talking to you guys on a new computer. Um, which is an Apple computer. And I've, I've been buying MacBooks for probably three, four years. Um, and sometimes you just want to buy something that works. You know what I mean? Like I used to be buying these Windows computers and they always crap out and every few months they would just kind of suck. Um, and I bought my first MacBook in, I think, 2009 or something. And sometimes you just want to work with a company that like has thought things out for you and make sure it works. You know, so I can proudly say that's our company. Um, we've thought through things. We have helpful videos. We have helpful instructions so that the whole process is easy, fun, enjoyable. And there's some fun surprises along the way. Um, and I'm willing to pay more for a computer that really technically maybe is the exact same as the, the window stuff, but I know what's going to work every time. I know when I'm doing a live stream for over 500 people, I can just talk and I don't have to think about that stuff. And that's kind of the the vision that we have of Monkey Life. We're not the cheapest people. We're never going to be the cheapest people. But I think the value uh, that we provide, and I think that the um, you know the return for your dollar is the best with Monkey Life. But obviously, I'm pretty biased, guys. I own the company. So don't take my word for it. Take our client's word for it. Check out our reviews. Uh, yes. Easy peasy. How long does it take to get my book? So... I don't know when you ordered the book, but uh, we're going to be sending them out soon. Canada Post has been like months behind on some deliveries. So um, we'll send everybody the digital copy because we now have a PDF. So you can get the digital copy like ASAP. But the physical copy, uh, hopefully it gets to you as soon as Canada Post allows. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Are all your books sold out? Um, I think they almost are. But I think we, if, if we sell a few more than we have made, we'll make more. But um, we're going to do a lot limited run. And then um, starting in the spring and summer, we're going to have a, a more production run of the Bunky. And we're going to release it on Amazon. And my goal is to get it up to a bestseller. So, yeah. Okay. So, sorry. Ladder is a slightly lighter unit, but steeper. Max load on these was close to a 1,000 kilograms safe working load. So, 450 pounds. Okay. Working load is 450 pounds. Okay. We're still talking about an enormous human being, 450 pounds. Uh, yeah, so we got, that's pretty solid. Okay. If I requested you build on site, can tin be bought as well? Yeah. When So thank you for clarifying that question, Joyce. So when we build on site, we always recommend a metal roof. We always bring the metal roof and install the metal roof generally uh, because it's the best product. Don't, don't put... Uh, for goodness sakes, don't put like something like the asphalt shingles, like Andura. They're not good. Not good. They will crap out in a year. Um, uh, if you have to do shingles to match your house or cottage, I understand. But get the best quality you can because uh, you don't want to be up on a bunky roof more than you have to be. It's pretty tall, especially the 2020. It's very tall. So if you can, spring for, throw a couple extra hundred bucks at this, this investment and put a quality metal roof. It'll last you a lifetime. Do it right. Do it once. That's my roof rant for the evening. Do you have payment plans? Yes, we do, Mandy Christine. We have a partnership with Paybright, so you can finance the bunkie and pay it off. All right. So Liz says, agree that the d slider door would be better than double doors. Yeah, the the we can do any door you want on that new on that new bunkie. Um, I think sliding doors is kind of what we're thinking right now. Sliding doors is better. <laughs> Leanne, are your mom and dad so, so proud of you? I don't know. They were here today. They didn't mention it. They like to withhold the pride. No, I'm just joking. My dad tells me he's proud of me a lot. Great parents. 
Would it be possible to add the trailer option later? Cost. I don't fully understand the question, Lori, but uh, you put down a deposit, we'll chat. I don't fully get the question, to be fair. Scrolling down, scrolling down. There's so many great questions here. How much does the trailer bunky weigh? I think it's approximately 4,000 pounds. So you need like a truck, like a, a decent Ford F-150 kind of like truck to pull it. I don't think you can pull it with a little Pinto or something. Where can we find these sales? Where on your site does it say winter sales? We're about to release that. So because it's not officially on, uh, if you if you want to order online, uh, we'll have it up soon, probably in the next 24 hours or so. Yeah, but it's basically it's $1,000 off the 2020 and the 2019 and then $500 off everything else except the bathroom bunky. That's, that never goes on sale. Do you guys have bunkies on site that we can look at? Yes, in normal times, yes. I would love to have you over to see all my bunkies here at uh, Bunky HQ. Um, I'm not sure if it's legally allowed, but uh, if you call me, uh, we can discuss the possibility of you coming in a COVID compliant way. How long can you hold it? Uh, indefinitely, we can hold the bunkie till whenever. Right. But this is a great question, actually. Are the bunkie trailers equipped with brakes? Yes, they have uh, a, a, a brake system because you need it with that big of a, of a trailer. So thank you for that question. Where in Kingston is the Four Season Bunkie Partner? Um, I'm not actually sure. I haven't been to the factory yet, but it's just outside Kingston. So... I'm hoping to win the bunkie and buy the outhouse. Possibly second bunkie on bacon property. Well, I wish you all the best of luck. Bonnie Thomas. All right. Scrolling. Oh, Keith says top 25. Unfortunately, I'm not going to read that tonight. I didn't prep that. I apologize, Keith. Do, do, do. Scrolling right down. Love the trailer. Can you do a sliding door in the interior? Oh, okay. That's what you're saying. Sliding door in the interior takes up less space. Yeah, that, we could probably pull that off. Do you have a sale only once a year? No, we have we have sales. We usually have a like um usually on long weekends we'll have smaller sales, but they will. I promise you, they will not be as big. This is the best sale, sale of the year. Um, if we do a sale on May long weekend, depending on where we're at with inventory, um, it will be good, but it won't be as good. And prices may have doubled by <laughs> maybe not doubled, but prices will have gone up possibly because of the way uh, our current wood situation looks like in Canada. Carla, what a well-designed concept of website. So easy to maneuver. Well, thank you can thank Heather for that. And I thank you as well, Heather. Okay. Wendy, your live streams are entertaining, but I'm very informative. Well, thank you very much. Okay. Do you offer heated floors? If not, yes, uh, we will be offering heating floors heated floors uh, in the new insulated bunky on the old one um no like on the older water ones I, we don't offer heated floors <laughs> what are the sale prices is that on your site uh so the, sorry the sale the sale starts on february 7th officially it's, let's just say it starts now but the it'll be on the website shortly um it'll start and it will end on valentine's day so you got to get your orders in between now and valentine's day okay so not after after Valentine's Day is when we're going to chat with everybody that put a deposit down and see if they want to move forward with their purchase. Before Valentine's Day is everybody that wants to buy our typical bunky products, our, our uh, all of our wood products. So like I said, if you're if you're if you need something, you've been talking to the family, you need that extra space. It's the best time to buy before Valentine's Day. Thank you for that comment. Some say my mic's low. I'm going to crank my mic up again. Have you made any for those who live in Nova Scotia? Yes, we have a, uh, a Nova Scotian bunkie. If you'd like to go see it, it's a 2019 loft bunkie. And uh, just email in and we can set you up if you want to go see one physically. But we, yeah, we sold to Nova Scotia for sure. We've sold Nova Scotia, New Brunswick, Ontario, BC, um, and hopefully Alberta soon. So, Leanne asks, if you own a bunkie, do you have a Facebook page to chat with each other? Um, well, there is the Bunky Life Facebook page, uh, Bunky Life. Or sorry, Facebook.com slash Bunky Life. Um, although we're considering having a smaller kind of intimate group. Actually, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Would you, if you're a client, there's I know there's clients on this call or on this stream. 
if you're a client, would you rather have like a more intimate group where you can kind of more be in charge and we can moderate a little bit, but it's more like bunky lifers interacting together? Um, I think it'd be great. Um, but, uh, cause like right now people will comment on, on bunky life, the Facebook page, but it, it gets lost sometimes. Um, and I'd like to kind of build that community a little stronger. So we've been discussing the idea. Um, if you think you get benefit from that as a client or maybe a, a soon to be client, uh, let me know, comment below. Would you be in on a, you know, a, a group would be a group. I think, um, I love the idea. I don't love the fact that Facebook kind of owns this group, but, uh, we could figure something out. So anyways, that's really great. Uh, you're not the first person to just suggest that this week. Shelly, no one can predict the future. A bunky life for me. No one can predict the future, but winning would set us free. No one can predict the future. 43 years of marriage has been my joy. No one can predict the future, but winning a bunky, boy, oh boy. Now that was some serious E.E. E. Cummings level epicness. Are all your new books signed by you? Yes, they are. Absolutely. We made 150 copies. I think they're all sold out. We'll make a few more uh, signed by me. And uh, and all the money goes to Ronald McDonald House. So if you buy one, all the proceeds after we pay for the cost of the book go right to Ronald McDonald House. These books are awesome. Stories of a bunky life client. Um, journeys. My personal story that I shared pretty intensely uh, last Last, this past Tuesday. Also, like how to build, all that good stuff, right? It's all in, in that one book. Everything I've learned in the past five years in one book. Thank you for the kind words, everybody. I'm scrolling. I don't know if I'm getting to the bottom of these comments or not. I feel like I'm not. Have your books all sold out? I'm looking, I can't find it. No, they're not. Well, if, here, I'm going to type in bunkylife.com book. If you go to bunkylife.com slash book, you can still order them. All right. Great comment. Do, 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 do. Are the bunkies 100% waterproof? Um, yeah, like the wood bunkies, if you've sealed them properly, like we recommend, um, like the, the way the tongue and groove comes together on the wood products, it's, uh, it's very it's water, water cannot penetrate into them scrolling down how much oh here's a good question karen how much money did you end up raising for ronald mcdonald's after the last live stream okay we don't have the tallies because i don't know we haven't really been counting how many books we sold but it was a lot so there's the books and then there's the uh there's the people that donated directly and then there's the people that bought bunkies we'll have to tally that up um, and we'll probably do so after Valentine's Day. But uh, I know there was over $1,000 worth of donations. I might, might be a little bit... Uh, hold on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to check this live. Okay. Bunkylife.com slash give. If you go to bunkylife.com slash give, it won't show you the total amount, but it will show you uh, where we're at from people d directly donating. I'm going to share the screen here. Okay, so I'm raising, we're at 1245 dollars That's just people donating directly. That's not the the total because we most of the money comes from uh, when people buy a bunkie and we donate a portion of that. So that's where most of the donations come from. But then the people donate directly and then they buy books as well, which which everything adds up. So last year, last year as a total of year, it was in the ballpark of like thirty seven thousand. So Shelly asks, what are the high score numbers? Okay. I'm not going to release that tonight. Sorry, Shelly. I didn't prepare them. Oh, okay. Canada Post had a COVID shutdown, so they're slower. Thank you for letting us know. We mailed some of the Bunky books out in like this early December, and people are just getting them today or yesterday. Um, so, you know, <laughs> uh, just one of those things. I'll have to put up with it. Tammy says, you get what you pay for. I'll stay with Bunky Life. I think that's generally true in life. Quality and longevity are more important than cheap. Well, thank you, Terry. I appreciate that. Has anyone in, uh, winterized a, a Bunky with foam insulation and siding? Um, not to my knowledge yet, but it is doable. 
It's a big job though. I think a better option is just go ahead and buy uh, the the new Bunky, like the new system. We can Jennifer. The book is fantastic. Highly recommend. Well, thank you, Jennifer, and I'm I'm uh, very very appreciative that you'd say that. If the new ladder is in the 2019 with loft, can you still fit a queen bed on the main floor? Great question. I'll have to do some measurement. I, I think so, but uh, let me double check that for you, Lori. I don't want to say yes. Bunkies should be great for the economy for people to rent out to help pay down their taxes on a large property. I'm living proof of that. Uh, that helped us pay for our mortgage and our top property tax for a long time. That's how, that's how we got started in, in the bunkie game. Scrolling down, scrolling down. Don't be dissing Canada Post. Yeah. No, I know you guys work here. I'm not trying to say anything bad about Canada Post. I'm just saying uh, when you're when you're um, when you're relying on Canada Post and COVID's going down, you have to lower your expectations. Not in a bad I don't mean that in a pejorative way. I just mean we all have to realize that it's impossible for packages the 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 mail volume probably doubled or tripled over Christmas and everybody's sick. Uh, and they're not able to work as closely. So, I mean, it's a recipe for people are going to get their packages late. Sorry. <laughs> My apologies to everyone that didn't get their book on time. I was hoping it would be before Christmas. Some people did get their book before Christmas, but some people are still waiting. Um, so just one of those things. Do, do, do. Can you anticipate the new ladder cost coming down in price? Hopefully we're negotiating that right now. Um, how can we make it still high quality but maybe a lower price point we're working on that but the one i got today uh and put in my bunkie i can see why it's worth three grand like i i can understand why it's a very quality like you got the the detail on the thing and the way it's formed and the solidness of it um i can understand why it's worth three grand can you put a fireplace in any of your bunkies check out uh can i live in my bunkie on youtube that should be the answer to your question is there a bathroom bunkie available? Yes, there is. Uh, it, basically, it's a small shed, basically a small outhouse kind of thing, and then you could add your own uh, facilities from there. It's under product slash bathroom bunkie, it's called. What is the cost of the 2019 bunkie with loft if you, we had uh, us install it? Um, probably the install cost on that is in the ballpark of like 3,800 plus the cost of the kit. It's uh, normally 9,000, but it's on sale for, um, 79.95. So probably ballpark about $11,000 roughly just as a rough kind of done for you price. Jillian says, I love your story and how brave you were in sharing your story of how the bunky life came to be. Fortunately, I can relate to your story. I admire how you and your wife turned such a terrible time into your life. Into Thank you. That's so kind to say Jillian and uh, sorry for your loss. Um, so if, if you didn't catch the last live stream, it was two days ago. Uh, it's called Bunky Life TV number four, how Bunky Life came to be. And I kind of shared my wife and I's journey and thank you for it. That's one of the reasons we share this story is that, uh, people don't talk about that a lot. And it's nice to know that you're not alone when you go through things like that. It was very helpful for us when people would share their story with us. David says, Hi, Dave. The four season also modulates extreme weather, both heat and humidity and cold, and the solid walls are pest resistant. Yeah, a lot of pluses that we'll continue to share as we learn more uh, and together and we work together to, to make the uh, the Bunky Life concept work in the four season environment. Uh, Sherry asks, how much did you raise for RMC? We talked about that already. Ben says, just ordered two. So excited. Oh, awesome. Yeah, we're excited to have his client, Ben. <laughs> Kevin says, trailer bunkie. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Any bunkies in BC to look at? Not yet, but there will be very soon. Very soon, Is Isabel. Do, 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 do. All right. I'm, I feel like I'm not anywhere close to getting to the bottom of this, and it's been an hour and ten. Do you guys want me to keep going? I'm just going to keep going. I don't want to leave people out, I've, but I haven't mentioned the code word, which is very rude of me. I apologize. The code word, of course, is EPIC. E-P-I-C. The code word is EPIC. If, you got it, if you're just here for the points, get on out of here. If you've got more questions, I'm going to keep going until I get to the end. All right. Code word is EPIC. 
Joyce, are you singing us a, co- a song tonight before the code word? No, I just said the code word, so I won't be singing a song before the code word. But maybe I'll close off with a song. How far do we travel to build? So we have we have a really great team of clients, um, or sorry, of partners that can build anywhere in Ontario. We've got covered for sure, pretty much anywhere in Ontario. And then we're we're bringing on the preferred Bunky Life installers in other provinces as well. So if you're interested in in being or being considered, I should say, for for that, go to bunkylife.com/partners. Partners. Um, we we love to work with carpenters. But landscaping companies are great. Um, arborists, we have a really great arborist that that works for us all summer long. Um, we have uh, even just handy guys. Like you can just be like a maybe a computer scientist by day, but you love building bunkies on the weekend. It's a great chance to get out there, have, get some sunshine, get your hands dirty. Uh, you can make a pretty good amount of money. Um, and, uh, and the clients are great. The, honestly, our clients are the best people in the world. They're so fun to work with. Um, we don't have any weird people or like, so, um, you know, if you, if something you want to consider doing, apply here at bunkylife.com slash partners. Okay. doesn't matter where in Canada you are. We'd love to, to hear from you. Is there an expiry on the sale date of the price? If I leave a deposit now? No. If you, if you put a deposit in, you've locked in the price. Will I still get the discount if I wait for a year to buy the bullet? Yes. You'll get as soon as you put the deposit down, you've locked in the, the price, even if it's next year, which is uh, less than ideal for everybody. But if you get it within the year, it'd be nice. But we'll, we have some people that, for different reasons, have to hold it over the winter. No big deal. You can test drive cars by appointment only. Makes sense if you had bunky viewings by appointment only. Yes, we have bunky. On normal times, we have bunky appointments by, we have bunky viewings by appointment only anyways. And if we can legally do it, we will, but call us first before you uh, drive far to see us. Lynette, while you're doing this, we live and work at a campground. We'd love to win. Great. Yeah, we, we have tons of work with campgrounds and love love our campground clients. Wonder how far you travel as well. We live in Nova Scotia. Yes, we've installed in Nova Scotia. We can deliver anywhere in Canada for a relatively good price. Tyler Shaw, how's it going, buddy? Good to see you, man. Um, so Carly asked $500 deposit per bunkie. No, the $500 deposit is for the new products. The, uh, cool, uh, B compact ladders, um, or yeah, ladder system, um, the trailer bunkie and the new insulated bunkie. That's a small deposit. And that books you a, a chat after Valentine's day. We'll chat and we'll talk about your needs, get you a full quote together. Uh, the reason we're asking for a deposit is so we separate those who are serious from those who just want to ask a million questions and take up all our time. Um, obviously there's a spectrum <laughs> between the two, but we want to separate who's serious about this new product and who's just more in the informal phase. Um, so, uh, ask any questions you have about our traditional wood bunkies, but, uh, um, our, our deal with our wood bunkies is you put half down when you, when you buy it, half down when you, when you actually receive the delivery. So that's our, our general payment schedule. And it'll, it'll be the same for the new products, but I'm saying put down 500 bucks now so that we know, you know, you're, you're a serious person uh, and we can answer all your questions and, and have a real in-depth conversation with you. All right. Scrolling down. I don't think I'm going to, I'm putting a dent in these comments, but that code word once again is epic. All right. Oh my goodness. The little girl in the pick is so cute. That's my daughter, Declan. She's one year old. Okay. I, I'm seeing people say I haven't said the code word. I said it like 20 minutes ago. So I am slow. I apologize, guys. People are saying yes. Okay. Marsha says yes. People are saying yes. Okay. I think this is people saying yes to, they would like to see a private Facebook group for the Bunky Life community. I think that'd be cool. Michelle says, I would love a group of Bunky owners. Now notice Michelle, <laughs> thank you, is her, her Facebook profile picture is actually a picture of a Bunky that she owns. Very cool. Love it. Yeah, I think we're, I think we can do it now. You know, we've got enough followers. We're getting there. You know, um, I don't want to brag, but Harvey's retweeted us today. That's right. Harvey's the burger joint retweeted one of our tweets. It's kind of a big deal. Yeah. Yeah. So 
Bunky Life group you can join, see modifications people have made. Yeah, yeah, that's totally what I'm envisioning, place for fit. Um, and, like, we already kind of do that with the Facebook page, but it's, like, you can't really comment, you can't interact as much as I would like, so that's why I was thinking a group that uh, might be a little easier. That's what I'm thinking. Do, 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 do. Julie says, are leaks covered by warranty? Yes, absolutely. That's a problem. If you have a leak, either you haven't done a recommended uh, sealing and everything or uh, or we've screwed up. I, that's re- it's very rare that happens. Every once in a while, someone will have a weird thing and we can usually solve it on, at our expense. Can I buy the playing cards? And are the proceeds of those also going to Ronald McDonald's house? Yes. Let me show you those playing cards. So these are a small little thing that we put together. It's called Bunky Life Connection Cards. Um, and we still have a fair number of these left. You know, traditional playing cards for playing around the cottage, but also cool questions like, you know, what's the favorite? What's your favorite thing about yourself? Do you do you think aliens exist? That, that's a conversation stimulant right there. Okay, that's the idea. All right. Your charity work is a lasting to many. I'm not sure what a lasting means, Joyce. Do you have bunkies on Amazon? Yes, we do. Uh, we've started selling on Amazon a little bit, trying to dip our toe in that water. And we've actually sold a few that way. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> My cat is hungry. Any chance for the code word? It's still epic. I'm realizing I'm answering questions that you guys asked a long time ago. Can the ladder be closed while upstairs? Uh, we tried that today. I don't think so. Um, I don't think it's designed that way. Um, so that's almost like climbing up on your roof and then your ladder falls over. You don't want that. You don't really want that feature. <laughs> I don't think. Is the draw on the seventh totally random? Absolutely it is. Um, it's based on chances to win. So if you have more points, it's like you have extra chances to win, but it is random. It's decided by randomly on the basis of how many points you have. Anyone can win with one entry. Exactly right. What are the smallest size and price range? Our, our smallest bunkie is our um, summer cabin. Well, I guess it's a... Uh, bunkie bunkie is the summer cabin. We all have a little bathroom bunkie, but that doesn't really count. Our smallest bunkie is the summer cabin, and it is uh, 5500 uh, um, on sale as well. So, Betty says, you actually stood up for Canada Post in your last live stream. Yes. I mean... We need our mail, guys. <laughs> Canada Post is solid. What's the life expectancy of a bunkie? There are log cabins that have stood the test of time for like 100 years. I think you should be able to get 25 years, no problem, if you do the right maintenance. Put a good roof on it. Follow the maintenance of stain. Make sure everything continues to be sealed properly. Should be 25 years, no problem. No problem with the book not getting here. We know the postal community was overloaded. Exactly. So, thank you for understanding. Your new ladder is the stairway to heaven. Just need to add the music. That's cool. Shelly Lynn Passfield is, is the local poet. I love it. Can you install Murphy beds in the bunkie? Absolutely you can. Yes, you can. The walls are solid enough for that for sure. Is there room enough for bath facilities? Yeah, you could probably pull that off. I'm not a plumber though, so it might be, you know, you could pull it off though. Ah, okay. Suzanne, did you post the lady from the other night so we could see her bathroom bunkie? I still have to do that. I apologize. I have Isolina's videos and I just need to post them. So just keep checking the Facebook page. We'll, we'll get it up there. Sorry about that. Would those log bunk beds fit in the 2019 loft bunkie? Yes, they would. You can fit a queen size bed very easily back there. Man, I'm way behind on these comments. So sorry. Okay, people are sitting there. Finally, people are saying it's epic. Okay. Scrolling down. I hope this is still entertaining for you guys. I I find this fun, but I realize that, uh, um, yeah. Well, this is very kind. Doug Robertson says, I really love your songs and guitar playing. Your guitar technique is wonderful and your lyrics are emotional and touching. Thank you. Very kind, Doug. Brenda asks, was the last year's winner in one of the top 25? I don't believe so. 
I don't believe so. There's just, there's, you know, like anything, there's the Pareto principle, right? 80% of your people are here. And then there's that small 20% that have most of the points. But I think the way that it works out, there's actually more people in the 80% that don't do a whole lot. Maybe they, you know, just do all the steps on, do all the things you can do. Get up to about a thousand points and then you've really helped your chances. Is there a bunkie in Moncton? Yes, there is. Uh, Jennifer, email. uh, We have a client in Moncton uh, that has a really successful Airbnb. Email in and we can hopefully connect you with them if you want. Um, They have a 2018 loft bunkie and a little bathroom bunkie as well. Oh, thank you, Austin. How do you volunteer on one of your builds? Okay. uh, The way you do that is you apply. So bunkylife.com slash volunteer. Uh, I think we have a couple Make-A-Wish builds in the works right now. Um, So, uh, you know, we don't, yeah. If you go to bunkylife.com slash volunteer, just say where you're from, how handy you are, um, and then where you're willing to travel to do a bunkie. So if you're in Ontario, wherever you are in Canada, um, we can hopefully set you up uh, with a chance to volunteer. They're really fun, a fun day. um, And we kind of pay for everything and make sure it's all easy and have the tools there and stuff. And, uh, yeah, we're, we're hoping that that aspect of things kind of continue to grow. The cool thing is, like, most people that are Make-A-Wish kids end up staying in a Ronald McDonald does. So, you know, it's a good time. In the future, would you consider adding wood stove systems? We already have a partnership with Cubic Mini Wood Stoves. Check them out. Here's a good question. What's the difference between the 2019 Bunky with no loft and the 2019 Summer Bunky? So the Summer Cabin has slightly thinner walls, only has single pane windows, and then it has a double door system. The 2019 Bunky with no loft is is thicker walls, um, double pane windows, and uh, just a little more robust. The overhang is a little bit bigger, so it's a it's a bit more of a beefy product. Um, and I've insulated my roof on my no loft, and it's very usable most of the winter here. Um, but the summer cabin, you know, January to about March, it's pretty cold, even if you have a heater. So, yeah. Okay. I feel like I'm getting to the bottom of these comments, but maybe I'm not. All right. With the new bunkies on a trailer, you don't need to worry as much about the ground level. Yes, totally. Yeah, you can kind of level it off like you would any normal trailer. Even if sealed, how long before the wood would rot? If sealed, wood will not rot. Unless there's a moisture issue, wood doesn't rot, Um, especially the high-quality spruce that we use. Um, So if you seal it properly and you maintain it and you're not, you know, there's no leaks, there's no moisture issues, you should be fine. Like, like Like I say, there's wood, there's a lot of cabins from back in the day that are still up. After a hundred years, if you get wood rot, though, yeah, you're, you're, you're the time it starts ticking. Allison says, "I'm sorry, I'm confused, but where to put the 500?" So, if you want to just go on the website directly, you can do that. If you're like, "Oh, I don't get this," just email in. We can do the deposit the old-fashioned way. That's totally no problem. If you're wanting to put a deposit down on one of our new products. I'm doing my best to get to the bottom of these comments. I'm going. Okay. Is the floor slash foundation set up for a certain kind of footing? Um, There's a myriad of different ways to do your bunky foundation. If you check out how to build, I, I go into all the details of how to do that. All right. If you win the contest, can I pay you to deliver and set it up? Yes. Trying to order a book, but it's not coming up. Could you elaborate on that, Shelly McLeod? Here, I'll share what you need to do. You go to bunkylife.com. You're going to go to products. Bunky Life book. Blah, blah, blah. Add to cart. View cart. I think it's coming up. I think I think it's fine. That's how you got. That's how you got to do that. What about the chandelier with the battery powered you mentioned? Uh, that would be a question for Isolina. Um, she mentioned that. 
my apologies. I, I don't have the answer to that question. Delivery is extra, Andrew Glenny asks or, or comments. Yes, usually we can get most places in Ontario and BC for 500-ish um, and then more depending on where you are. But but usually we can get to any major city in Canada for $1,000 or less. And then depending on where you are, there might be some addition to that. But that's, that's a good kind of ballpark to think about. Where do we enter the code word? You're going to go to bunkylife.com and then click on the contest scoreboard under contest. I entered the contest a while back. Where do I enter the code word? Do I have to, do I enter all over again? No. Um, if you go to the, um, I'll, I'll show you guys. Let me show you. You can go here. You're going to go, so it's bunkylife.com. Click on contest. Go to bunky contest scoreboard. And you'll see there's a widget that loads. If you're logged in, it'll show you this. If it says, instead of this, if it says enter to win, then just enter your original email and that's like logging back in and you'll be ready to go. Hope that's helpful. The code word, once again, is EPIC. All right. All right. Are there any floor plans without ladders? Yeah, we've got a no loft and a summer cabin. There's no loft involved. It's just a straight cabin, basically. But the ones that have loft have ladders. Or the new B-Compact fold-out stairs or fold out ladder. Which model is the prize? It's our 2020 Bunky with Loft. Do you seal the inside and outside? Uh, I should seal the inside and outside. I haven't sealed all my bunkies yet, but yes, we recommend for sure seal the outside with some caulking, um, just the corners. That's all you need to do. And then stain the whole, the whole thing with a good stain. Have you had issues with condensation inside in cold weather? Not too bad, no. Actually, not at all, <laughs> to be honest. All right, I, I'm, I'm out of it. I'm getting to the end of these comments. I will not give up, even though it's been almost an hour and a half. Uh-oh. I went to the link to volunteer. And only, okay. Let me just see if that's still working. Bunkylife.com slash volunteer. No, it's working. Can you guys see this? Yeah, that's what you want to do. Bunkylife.com slash volunteer. And that goes, you can apply for this. Just fill out all that stuff, okay? I think it is working. All right. Okay. My husband's family cottage is over 100 years old. was a logger's cabin. Uh, the wood was stained, looked like new. Yes, you got to keep, you got to keep maintaining wood. It's not, you know, you can't let moisture get into it. But if you do that, it should be good. Oh, Kelly says she bought the chandelier at Giant Tiger. Cool. Thanks, Kelly. That was the, the battery-powered chandelier. Shared to all the off-the-grid groups. Wonder if you explored that target market. Lots of buzz in these groups about bunkies. People who live off the grid. Yeah, check out. There's a, a, a really interesting guy named Dan who my daughter and I interviewed. Uh, we interviewed him again this summer. We haven't released that video, but there's a video, Can I Live in My Bunkie? Um, and he's, he's doing it. The guy's friggin' sweet. Really cool guy. Definitely one of my top 10 favorite clients, actually. Really cool guy. And he texts me cool stuff all the time. Uh, which model would you recommend to fit the most beds? One of our loft models, the 2019, 2020, you can fit some solid amounts of people in those bunkies. Like four, sometimes six, if you really push it. Can the 2020 be made 20 centimeters shorter? Eh, maybe. Email us about that. Custom stuff gets complicated, but we can do stuff like that if we really, really need it. Hmm. When I tried to order the book, there was no place to put my PC. I'm not sure if I understand the question. Could you rephrase that? Are the playing cards bilingual? No, that's a good idea for next edition. The first edition is just English. Sorry. Sorry to my Francophone audience. I apologize. Is it really possible to live in it full time? Yeah, you got to see this video. It's not for the faint of heart. Definitely not for the faint of heart. Check out uh, Can I Live in My Bunkie on YouTube. I used to spray linseed oil and water to protect cedar strip boats. Yeah, yeah, that works good. 
I know these are not cedar. Um, do you think that could work for the outside? Yeah, my, my parents use linseed oil in theirs and it works really good. Um, obviously, we, we recommend uh, Sanson because it's easy to use. Um, but but that's a good good and we can make them in cedar. We can we have the option of making some of our new stuff in cedar, costs way more. Just FYI. If you build a bunker with loft, I need to move it a few years later. Do you have to disassemble it? You would. Yeah, it's really tall, so you can't get it down the road. Do do do. Are there any bunkies in Sault Ste. Maria available for viewing? Eh, there's some at some camps. Because up at, once you get past Barry, everyone calls their at a camp. I'm up in my camp, going down to the camp. Um, so there are some at camps, but I don't know if they're open right now because they're probably buried in snow. So I don't know if there's any bunkies at Sioux to see. But uh, we can do a virtual tour. Let's virtual tour at Laura Sugar Field. Love the new ladder. Me too. I'm excited about it. How do you heat my bunk? I just heat my bunk with electric heat because I'm so close to the house. It's very simple to do that. So uh, my 2020 is really quite comfortably warm. I was in, I was wearing this today in my 2020 while we put the ladder in with just a couple little heaters in there. All right. I think I'm getting to the end of this. What time are you alive? 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Rachel Curry. Tune in. We enjoy listening to live streams. Is your 6x6 bathroom bookie on sale? No, it will never be on sale. It's always going to be the same price. That bunky is what we call a lost leader. <coughs> we don't make money. We just, we sell it to people so that they, that they have that full bunky life package. All right. Oh, okay. Carol, postal code. I'm trying to order again. Okay, Heather, this might be useful information. Carol is saying she can't enter her postal code when she orders her book. Not great. Okay, we'll try to fix that for you, Carol. Um, thank you for that feedback. All right, Carol says, preventive maintenance will expand the life of anything exponentially. That is so true. I think I've got to the end of, the, end of this. Once again, the code word is epic. Once again, uh, if you're serious about wanting to put one of these new products in your life, Email us at the very least and we'll figure out the deposit situation and we'll have a really good sit down chat about how we can put it in insulated bunky, a trailer bunky, or one of the epic new B compact ladders into your life. Uh, let's do that. And uh, once again, guys, it's been a pleasure. I hope you've learned something. I hope it's been entertaining. We'll see you on Sunday at 7 p.m. Don't miss it.